Hi, I'm Electric. Red Smash! And welcome back. To Riverdale. Hold up, this thing is really off-centered. Hold up, this show is really good. And then she'll say, You always do it's good. So, um... Gosh. It's getting good. I have no idea who the killer is. Where are we at? Episode 9. I want to kind of jump into it and see what happens. <sighs> Seriously, I've been seeing like promos for the second season. I haven't seen anything, but I just, it looks awesome. <laughs> but yeah, so, this is Riverdale. Season 1. Episode 9. La Grande Illusion. Illusion. Lucy Home. It was a question that brought the wolves to Riverdale. And now, the Blossoms were circling the wagons against possible attack from within their own ranks. Polly won't answer my question. You're so cute. Oh, madam, breakfast is ready. I'm not hungry. Ever uh, since, according to your milk toast father, great grand milk Blossom toast, killed great grand Happy Cooper. Well, it's, it'll make me feel better. Word has it that the Blossom Board of Trustees has descended upon Riverdale like a cabal of vampires. Why? <laughs> cabal. Now that's a story. No shit. Your father found out about Fred and me. Someone else does. Archie, if music be the food of love, play on. Oh. Play on. Oh, what are you doing? I think I was thinking get through it. Cheryl, I would love to help. Cheryl, hold on. Oh, she knows how to play in like a fight. They put me in a wooden box as I desperately put a Veronica Lodge specialty. So, if you're free tomorrow, come over for lunch and pampering. Kevin will be there. Yeah. It'll be fun. Just I'm sorry, please say this. <laughs> I'm going to do it. Oh, good. good girl. She is she's a good character. First of all, I was going to get Principal Weatherby to summon you. Hey, this is Blossom. Have a moment to chat? About you. I believe she invited you to our tree tapping ceremony. Yeah. Some music. Is that true? Oh. Did she tell you her great uncle Harrison sits on the board of the Brandenburg Music Academy? They have an excellent summer program, I hear. It's amazing. Crazy hard to get into. Fuck! Not for a talent like you. Especially not if I put in a word on your behalf. Mrs. Blossom. The news. And I'll call Are they gonna try to make Archie the heir just because he has red hair? Air. Why? Okay, there, that's a question I want to answer. Why does he have red? I know in the comics he has red hair, but his dad doesn't even have red hair. Uh, if it happens, though, we'd be huge. Hold on, hold on. You have to audition for it? Well, not exactly, Mrs. I think it's a great idea. Thank you, Betty. <laughs> and while you're there, would you talk to Polly for me? I just want to make sure she's okay. Definitely. I can take care of myself. Famous last word, there she comes. True enough. Okay, so uh, real uh, quick, we don't know what his mom looks like. No, we don't. So, maybe she has extreme red hair or something. When Jason died, I thought I'd So they have to prove themselves to the Board of Trustees. Why are all the Board of the Trustees redheads? They're probably all part of the family. Mrs. Lodge, it's Chief Florine is to die for. Mugs? Oh, uh, shit. It's Dutch. We lost the third. Do you want my grandpa man Fred came over? Oh. What's Mux? Archibald, come join us. I could tell. Hermione uh, looks like she's upset. Okay. That's exactly when she should worry. Oh, there's something that you need to know about that Mux girl. Okay. What? Well, from what I've been told, the Mux family is going to testify against your father. They should. How many, Mom? How many families like Ethel's? It's the risk of doing business. See, that's. This is why I gotta give props to Veronica, because she really does want to do the right thing. I don't buy this dog and pony show for a second. Underestimate her. And don't bet against her. Get fucked! See, Archie's a good guy too. He is. I oh God. Uh, Sent thugs to beat up teenagers. Clifford didn't send those thugs. It's a lot to process. You know, when Cheryl told me that she wanted you to come with us, I was a little taken aback. You have to come. I'm worried you're already in. 
Yeah. I need a proper suit, don't you think, Daddy? I don't like to look at you. Or, yeah. You just have a problem. Plus. Okay. Well, you're screwing over his yeah. dad. Yeah. yeah. Stop we screwing. We won't take no for an answer. Then stop screwing over my dad. Are right, you hurt? Dr. Patel just confirmed it this morning. Polly is having twins. <gasps> Bless her blossom jeans. And she didn't call to tell me. Hostages aren't normally allowed to make it. I remember. Cheryl. That was a joke, you hobo. Of course, I'll give her your message, buddy. But no promises. Hey, those are our jeans, thank you. <laughs> I'm your friends. Me too, Ethel. What's up? Mr. Andrews! Nice haircut. Looking extremely dilfy today. Dilf? Cheryl. Yeah, nice woman cometh. <laughs> There's he is on the Has a miss so so for coming to the table. I want pizza now! Fuck, I'm sorry to give you this. <gasps> An 84 Les Paul. And our signature color. You're welcome. Oh my god. Okay, that's. <laughs> Archie's just like. Oh. <laughs> He's like. <laughs> Shit. I'd give that back if I were you. Dad, come on. The Blossoms, they're helping me get into that summer music. No, it's going over your father! Okay, look, like, his hair is not that... It's, it's interesting. When he's around the Blossoms, I think they... Highlight on his just, hair. Yeah, exactly. Watch this. The... Oh, you're gonna break it, yeah. I want my daughter back! <laughs> you bastard! Instead of helping me with that music school, if maybe you could help my dad. Are you negotiating on behalf of your father? No, 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 no. I'm impressed. Oh. In fact, I'm trying to imagine if Jason would ever have given up something like that for me, and I don't believe so. It speaks to your character, son. Wow. But I'll tell you what. Okay, I'm sorry. sorry. Yeah. It's like, you know how in a time of crisis people either come together your family is definitely splintering right now, but it won't fall apart because of you. Because you're holding them together. You're so much stronger than all of the white noise. You're stronger than your mother. You're stronger than your father. You are holding this family together. So don't.
Uh, Archibald! Archibald! What are you doing? What is go- what is this? It's like sand. What is this? He seems satisfied when Uncle Redford keeps asking about the driving lab. I am so close to getting that lab back. I'm mining a lot of little crumbles. Oh, that's not so resourceful. Maybe you should have sent her to jail instead of hire <laughs> What is happening? Done. Lying for dad. Are you sure you want to do that to your dad? Oh. Sure, I think there's a favor to your mom to help you. <laughs> oh, Archie. Don't start lying now. The school newspaper. Yeah. That's what we are. For now. But I'm pretty sure that our annual operating budget is bigger than the registers. I'm done with you. Ever since we started dating, you've ignored me. You've ditched me. Val, please. Let me make it up to you. Sorry, Archie, but unlike you, I won't be bought. Oh my god! And that was just what I was Oh, oh Listen, middle of the So many families have been hurt by the lodge. That's a really big share. No shit! I'm sick of you people using me and my family as pawns. Sure. He's just done. He is, and rightfully fucking so. He's fucking done. It's not Veronica's fault. The sins of the fathers. That's all. It's not your fault what your dad did. And you were there for me when no one else was. More than once. See, it's not taken if you want it. Exactly. She was even there for you with, well, it seemed with that Betty. for Veronica, the sins of the father would remain simply that. The family, their legacy, that's a motive. So, that was Riverdale, and it's fucking awesome, and it just gets better. Mm-hmm. Better and better and It sucks, because, like, Archie's just, like, he's just trying to do the right thing, but he always, always gets, like, tangled up. But that's why I think I like both Archie and Veronica. They both are trying to do the right thing, but for it's not their reasons. fault for, like, actually all the kids. Paul, Betty, Jughead, Veronica, and Archie. Well, those are our four main characters. Yeah, but they all, in their own way, have other outside shit to deal with. Right. That is not their fault, but they're trying to do the best they can. It's a lot of the sins as the parents. Except for Archie. Archie's dad's fine. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Archie's dad is just like, I'm so fucking done with all you fucking bitches, so looks like I'm just going to be working and I'm going to be taking money. Done. It's like, all right. <laughs> I'm thinking now Hiram killed Jason. Well, that's just Or maybe hired someone. Obviously, he's in jail, so he, he couldn't physically do it. He works with it. the serpents. So maybe he hired Jughead's dad to do it. I don't think Jughead's dad did it, though. He has a lot of cronies. Somehow, some way, that that's just how they did it. But that also means that he is... An accomplice. An accomplice, exactly. All right. This was Riverdale. See you guys on the next one. <laughs>